Hey, so it is currently 7:35 Eastern Time. Yeah, we're gonna go out to Hell's Kitchen, which is like a neighborhood purely of restaurants. Let's see if we can find something there. You know, who knows? We're at the Jolly Monk. A few moments later. Our dinner is passed at the Jolly Monk. It's good. I like it. There we go. All right, we are out of the Jolly Fire. Working our way back to the hotel. It's a pretty nice night. It's balmy. Probably like 40 degrees. Maybe 45. I'm going go with 45. It's nice and quiet too. So for the fourth time today, we have arrived in the vicinity of Times Square. This time from a brand new where we ate left. No, you can ask me right? Diner. Who's terrible at great show? The star, whatever it is. Oh, oh, the Stardust yeah. Diner. That was nice. It was nice. Essentially, what it is, it's a. Um, you go to so many stores. We're gonna walk right past it. But essentially, it's an M world. Oh, that looks so tempting. I know. Yeah, it's easy. It's like, oh, I don't even have to cuss that much. I didn't. Hershey's right here. Hershey kisses. The quest for ice cream, do ice cream doth continue. Our first frozen yogurt place was closed. And so now we continue on to the land, uh, what was it called? The world of ice cream and nuts? World of ice cream and nuts, yeah. I belong. Yeah. Our quest doth rage on. Our dedication to frozen confectionaries is too strong to quit. But anyway, we're making our way towards Rockefeller Center, hoping maybe we'll find something there, but who knows. Find out. So, whilst we are at this individual place of awesomeness, there's the flags, iconic landmarks. Let's do it! Why not? of New York. Long quest for Froyo has been completed. Strawberry sensation. Yeah. I wonder if it still works. It's a dream come true. Why didn't we come here in the first place? Day two. <laughs> in Central Park, it's awesome. Yeah. Here I am, Central Park, New York City. I'm standing on top of a large rock. It's got an awesome view. But I better catch up with my uh, group. Is that a churro? So I have that. Nice. It looks like it has cream cheese in the middle. Mm -hmm. oh, that's like... Ooh, it looks like we got some Irish music. Pretty sure those are drunks. Oh, I am interested.
Curse that flash. We're professionals. That's why we work on the streets. Your name to name is White Chocolate. Sunday the 13th, uh, day two, I guess you could say, maybe one and a half of New York. We just got back from the tour of Central Park and just walked around and found some stuff. Most of the people stayed. Two others elected for the subway. But yeah, so now we're going to walk back to the hotel and just look at the sights. So, $32 later, Empire State Building, further that way is the Statue of Liberty. I think my finger's somewhere over it, right there. Empire State Building, not as magnificent as portrayed in the movies. Statue of Liberty, right there. Everything looks so tiny from up here, except maybe that. How is that taller and it doesn't have an observation deck? And what the heck is that? It's a skinny, skinny building. But how does that thing not blow over in the slightest? Like halfway through Central Park. Yeah, we got to those. The edge of the lake. No, we got. That's Turtle Lake, that big one. No, 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 yeah. no, it's not because we didn't pass the huge. What lake did we make it to? Okay, look at the uh, look at the baseball diamonds. There's like six of them right by the lake. Now, if you look back to, and to the left slightly, you see a spire and a flag. Oh, that's the castle we got to, which is where Turtle Lake was. It's like barely halfway. I know. <laughs> yeah, because right across from us. Yeah. So, here we are in Brooklyn, headed towards the Brooklyn Bridge because it has nice views, apparently. I don't know, I've never been there. I guess we'll have to wait and see. Hey, so, here I am. I really meant to uh, take a picture, but I'm just going to roll with it. Brooklyn Bridge. City skyline, Freedom Tower. Hi. Uh, yeah, that's about all I know. We have gotten quest number one out of the way. We have found the Brooklyn Bridge right there. Quest number two is to find a way to get on it so we can cross it. That one's tentative right now. Still haven't found the end to it. Maybe we'll find it. Maybe we won't. Game's optimistic. I'm just kind of cold. No, I'm joking. It's like 54 degrees out. We're fine. Finding the end may be a little more tricky than the weather, though. We were wrong. We still haven't found the beginning of the bridge. Maybe we never will. We another park. But we did go through another park. Hey. I am not the person who's neither positive nor negative. I'm just documenting all this. It's going to be one heck of a movie. A couple more false turns. I'm pretty sure we found it now. Oh I'm pretty gosh. sure. It looks promising to me. <laughs> I see so people walking. There are people walking, so I'm pretty sure we're close to the end. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Yep, we found All it. Their phones. We don't, we know. Okay. <laughs> now, how far down do you have to go to get to it? Hey. I love the way to the Is that a subway literally right there? Okay. Victory has finally been achieved. We have found the entrance, and I'm sorry, uh, Gabe can't make it. A bit too heavy for that. The pinnacle of the Brooklyn Bridge. It was a fun expedition. Okay, because it looks cooler. And two bicycles. Oh my. Oh my. 
Statue of Liberty to the left. Manhattan Bridge to the right. Dead ahead, one big ass suspension bridge. Yeah. Ground zero of the 9-11 terrorist attacks right next door. Good old American ingenuity and resilience. We have two of the new Twin Towers. I'm pretty sure one of them's been finished. And the other one closest, that's like half black, hasn't. Yeah. There we go. National pride. Ooh, yeah. All right, we finally made it. It's true, we did. I feel like a better human being. Oh, yeah. Okay. It took us long enough to find the beginning of the bridge in the Brooklyn side. But now yeah. we okay. have found the bridge, Someone we have crossed it, okay. and we are now in Manhattan. It was awesome. Day three. I just got back from the Late Show with Stephen Colbert. It was hilarious. I got back, I called my friends and buddies. Then I was like, hey, where are you guys at? And they're like, oh, we're at Applebee's in Times Square. There are multiple things wrong with that sentence. One, Applebee's. We are in New York, New York City, home to such diverse culture and therefore diverse food. Two, in Times Square. Everything is more expensive in Times Square. It doesn't matter what you get. I spent like $34 on two appetizers today. Like the four of us, we had, we ordered two appetizers at TGI Friday on Times Square. $34, I'm not sure if that's TGI Friday normally is. But it's really expensive. So, one, you're in New York and you're having Applebee's. Two, you're in New York having Applebee's and in Times Square. You're wasting your money and you're wasting your time. So, I'm going to find an Irish pub and grill because there's one on every corner. So, I'm going to find an Irish pub and grill, then get in contact with my friends because they don't know how to enjoy life when they're in New York City. Hot dogs, okay, fine. I guess you could get a street vendor hot dog. That's fine. Pizza, definitely. Uh, subs, probably. Applebee's? No. Absolutely not. So, told you that their little expedition was towards Applebee's, which is just downright moronic. I went with the classy restaurant and went to the stagecoach, that place right behind me. Had finger smash, it was good. And on the other hand, they have no taste. The stagecoach tavern and pub, right? There. Focus. There we go. Okay, so walking down the hall to my room. My foot kind of hurts all of a sudden. Ow. Ow. And there's the man who thought Applebee's was a better choice than an Irish pub. I didn't. We went to. Uh-huh. Two hours later. That place where we're going to carry each other. Well, you guys are ready. We're going to be in nasty shape when we get home. I'm probably going to have to reload my card again after this next stop. Did we get on the wrong side? That's weird though, because the one we came down said our way, didn't it? This one says uptown. Well, isn't that where we came from? Okay, we've been to Chinatown, let's go. No, buddy. Wait. I was just thinking. Uh, okay, yeah, I that had like five stars oh, you on, guys, uh, on Yelp. Ooh. Hello, Little Italy. I think it's Little Italy. I think it is. 
I don't know, Joe. But you've still got... Oh, if it's gelato, you've got me. But we're staying inside. I'm yeah, not, I'm not going to eat gelato out here. Okay, I'm happy. That is really loud. You're lucky we found gelato, bro. I wouldn't have been happy otherwise. Tim, I'm so happy we stopped in. Oh, yeah. catch Neither did I. Oh, those were big drops. Yeah. This is like half Chinatown, half Little Italy. Mm. I still don't get what's it. What's with the no standing signs? The no what? The no standing. That sign that you just walked past, it says no standing any time. Alright, so where's the nearest subway station? I think we should just keep walking that way. Okay. Oh, there's this way. Alright, thank you. Thanks. Ha 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 ha, sure. You're like, yeah, let's walk that way. But I totally meant that way. Ooh, that's cold. Whoa, what's this? Nope. No, I don't. No trespassing, soliciting, or loitering. I care not to do either because it's too cold to do any of them. Otherwise, if we're warm enough, I would totally loiter because I've got nothing better to do. Hey, mattress. Who wants to take that back to the hotel? All right, we have returned from our trip to uh, Chinatown, China. Little Italy, the financial district, specifically the, the 9 11 memorials. It's 11.31 at night. We left at about what, 9, 8? Which one? 8 or 9? You don't know, whatever. Point is, we got a great night. I probably covered all of Manhattan by now, at least north south wise. I'm not sure about the east west part. Or is it the east west I've covered all of? Whatever. All right, um, today is sadly the last day in New York. It is Tuesday the 15th, which, yeah, it's our last day in New York. It's kind of sad. Foghorn by Del Mar College. Second, the Sentinel, North Idaho College. And in first, Los Angeles Collegiate by Los Angeles College. Second place in math. One last shove off. Yeah. Oh, it's Papa Francesco. Oh my God, that's I heard you, Papa Francesco. That's why I won't. I told him I'm actually. I'm actually. All right, so we bought our train tickets after leaving uh, the hotel. We won second place for junior colleges. Pretty good. But yeah, we went to go find some food. I'm thinking a restaurant, but I'm not too picky, so not Whole Foods. So now we're just looking for a park. We're going to eat the Penn South Playground. Penn South Playground it is. Sweet. Hi, Gabe. I like how you looked up first. Flat iron building right there. By park. I think it's like a... What is this, Union Square? Madison Square. Madison Square Park. Or Madison Square, I don't know. Eating lunch. Whole Foods. Probably a Yay, we're on the train.